Pilates Flow and Yoga Body Sculpt. My name is Sophia. So I have a great full body body sculpt routine that will use standing Pilates, Pilates and bar exercises that will sculpt the entire body and make you sweat. So let's get started. We'll start with a quick stretch. We're gonna open those legs up, big healthy breath in and exhale, breathing in and out. Now we'll inhale and let's stretch forward. Just relaxing down if you feel any discomfort in the lower back or the knees, you can bend the legs. But we'll go over to one leg and then we'll go to the center and let's go to the other leg. And back to the center. Bending the legs, folding the arms, using the abs. Let's slowly roll up, firing up the thighs, the abs, the glutes. Big healthy stretch up. Exhale, arms go down. Okay, standing hundred. So Mary and me, we're gonna get the right leg up arms out and a percussion breath. Five short breaths in, five short breaths out. We're going to pump the arms with the breath. Here we go. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, arms back. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Breathing in, two, three, four, five. Out, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four, five, exhale, two, three, four, five, inhale, two, three, four, five, exhale, two, three, four, fifty. Let's get the left leg up. Okay, standing tall. Inhale, two, three, four, five, exhale, two, three, four, five, inhale, two, three, four, five, exhale, two, three, four, five, inhale, two, three, four, five, exhale, two, three, four, five, inhale, two, three, four, five, exhale, two, three, four, ninety, inhale, two, three, four, five, exhale, two, three, four, a hundred. Okay, so standing tall, feet about hip width apart, we're going to do the roll up, arms extend, we're going to squat right down using the thighs, the abs, the glutes, and beautiful full body stretch. Down we go, and stretch. Let's go for eight more. Squat right down and open. Seven. And just a smooth, steady breath. Six. You got it. Five. Stay with me. Four. Three. Two. Last one. Okay, so let's open the legs and let's reach and reach. Beautiful stretch. And we're going to go for six more. And also turning through the waist. Five. Keeping the thighs strong. Four. Abs engaged. Three. Two. And one. Okay. Four reaches up. Here we go for four. Three. Two. One. Other side. Four. Three. Two. One, and release down. Okay, so arms up, standing court training, standing single leg stretch. So right knee comes up, arms go down, and the left. So you just want to mirror me, have great posture, and a smooth, easy breath. Eight more, also sculpting those arms, keeping them nice and straight. Seven, other leg, six, good, getting that heart pumping harder. Five, knee right up, four, Three, and left leg, two, and one. Good. Relax the arms down, double leg stretch. So we're going to keep the feet hip width apart. Let's start with a full body stretch. We're going to go down and then slowly come right up. Don't forget your full stretch. Right down. And full body stretch. Getting the back muscles as well. Eight more. Seven. And lengthen. Six. Strong abs and thighs. You got it. Five. Okay, we're just keeping our breath fluid and smooth. Four. Three. And right up. Really feeling that buttocks heating up. Two. Okay, last one. We're just going to go down and hold. Nice deep bend. Drop the tailbone round through the lower back for four. Three. Two, one, good. Stretch your right up, relax the arms down. All right, so next three exercises, we're staying with the right leg. 
So you just want to mirror me. We're going to get the right leg extended, arms out, shoulders down and back. The knee comes in, leg extension. We're going to extend the leg, but if you can, don't let the foot touch the floor. It's a little more balance work. We're going for eight more. Seven with our arms out, sculpting those arms. Six. Five. Good. Four. Imagine you bounce the book on your head. Three. You want the weight in the center of your body. Two. And one. Good. So we'll relax the foot down. Arms out. Shoulders pull down and back. Hey, I'm going to gently soften those elbows a little bit. Really allowing us to lengthen a little more through the upper and mid back. Chest stays lifted. Now leg to the side. We'll pull the knee in. Inner outer, inner outer thigh. Leg extends. Good. Eight more if you can. The foot doesn't touch the floor. Seven. You got it. Six. Five. Four, keep that beautiful stretch through those upper mid back muscles. Three, hoping to improve our posture. Two, chest stays lifted. And one. All right, so we'll touch the foot down, arms in front. Let's take the right leg back and we're going to bend the left leg. Okay, bending that supporting leg slightly. And this will help us to give, a, give us a little more flexibility through the lower back. Okay, navel it. Stay with me. We're going to pull that knee in and extend. Now, really targeting through the glutes. We've got eight more. Extend that leg. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Hang in there. Two. And one. Relax the arms down. Relax the leg down. Shake it all out. Okay, so let's do our left leg. Standing tall. Left leg extends. Let's have really good posture. Shoulders down and back. Okay, eight more. Seven. See if you can pull that needle in it even more. Six. Five. Lengthen. Four. Fully extend the leg. Three. You got it. Two. One. Arms up. Shoulders pull down. Elbows soft. Okay, and let's get that beautiful stretch to the upper mid back. Chin parallel to the mat. We're going to have eight more of these. Seven. Inner outer thigh. Six. You got it. Five. Four, three, two, and one. Arms in front, legs pulls back. Let's bend that supporting leg. And now we pull the knee in and stretch. Okay, eight more. Seven more. Six, five, four, three. Two, and one, and relax the arms down, relax the legs up. All right, so now we're gonna finish off with some twisting. So getting thighs and glutes, but the twisting is really good to help trim on the waist and, and burn some fat in our belly. So arms out, we're gonna just twist to the right side, okay, and then we're gonna slowly come right up. A nice big twist, and see if you can get your left hand to the outside of the right leg. Okay, so a nice twist, we're going for eight more. And a deep lunge for thigh and glutes. Seven more. Six. Five. And up we go. Four. Three. Feel a nice squeeze through the belly. Two. Last one. Let's twist. Hold and breathe for four. Three. Two. One. Coming up. And let's go to the other side. And stretch right up. Deep lunge and stretch. Eight more. So we're toning and strengthening the muscles. Seven, but also stretching and lengthening. Six. Five. Good. Four. Three. Two. Last one. Let's twist and hold for four. Three. Two. One. We're going to come up. And relax the arms down again. Okay, shake it all up. From the top, let's do a flow, four of everything, starting with our standing single leg stretch. Okay, here we go. Arms up, draw the navel in, beautiful full body stretch. So mirror me with our right leg for four. Now left leg. 
three. Okay. Arms pumping, two. Heart pumping harder, one. And now we have our double leg stretch. Let's go right down. Thighs and glutes, use those abs. Full body stretch, four more. Three, so take your time. Make sure you fully extend, two. Root the feet down, reach the arms up, and one. Good, let's start with those double, those, sorry, single leg extensions with our right leg for four, three, two, one, arms up, leg to the side, four, three, shoulders pull down, two, a little slightly soft, one, arms in front, bending the supporting leg, four, three, two, and one. Arms up, let's do our left leg for four. We've got three, two, one. Arms up, leg to the side, four, three, stretching, two, and one. Arms out, leg pulls back, supporting leg bends, four. Really extend, three, pull that knee right in, good shaping for the glutes, two, and one. All right, let's do our twisting. Arms up, legs extend, twist deep just to our right, and we're coming up for four, three, two, and one. Okay, let's go the other way. Four, three, two, and one. Good, we'll come up, relax the arms down. Let's go first position, heels together, toes apart. We're going to breathe in, full stretch, and out. Inhale, arms through by the ears. Let's go right down, and now relax right down. Any discomfort in the knees or the lower back, bend the legs. So with the head down below the heart, just reversing the flow of blood. So good for the, the skin, the brain. Helps to slow down the heart, cool the body off. And now we're going to bend the legs, still keeping the heels together, toes apart, fold the arms. Ragdoll arms and now slowly zip up the thighs, the glutes, the abs are going to stretch right up. Exhale down. Okay, so from here, let's go to the, if you have a mat, you're going to go to the back of your mat. We're going to stretch right up. Down we go. And we're going to walk the hands forward, just pausing for a downward dog, full body stretch, tailbone reaching up. Let's move into plank. Okay, 10 counts. Nice long back if you prefer, you can go on the elbows for 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Down we go. Let's press back. Okay, so now we're going to do a, a, a variation of active moving cat push up. So we're going to have the hands slightly outside of the chest, pressing the fingers and thumbs down. If you have any pressure in the wrist, though, you can always do this on your knuckles. So we're going to get our one leg up, strong core. Here, we're going to take the leg out to the side. Nice for the thigh and the buttocks. We're going to take the leg back, but we're going to add a push-up for arms and chest. Okay, so let's kick to the side, and then down we go. Okay, eight more. Good. Down and up. Seven. Six. Full body, arms, chest, thigh, buttocks. Five. And those abs are working hard to stabilize through the hips. Four. Three, and down, and up. Two, last one. Hey, okay, let's go six push-ups in a row. Here we go for six, five, four, three, keeping the legs straight, two, and one, and now flexing the foot. We're gonna keep the knee up, heel in, and extend. Pull it, and lengthen. Six more, five, hang in there, four, Three, two, and one, and now take it to a pulse for six, five, four, arms stay strong, three, two, one, down we go, four, three, two, one, good, let's do a quick child's pose, relax child's pose, arms at your sides, just stretch to the neck and shoulders, okay, so we're going to do it all over again, let's do our other leg, so, Pressing the fingers and thumbs down slightly outside of the chest. We're going to take that leg out. So now we're doing the other leg. Hips are leveled. Kick the leg out to the side. 
and with the chin up, it's a push up. And we're gonna go out to the side and push up. Let's go for eight more. Seven more. Keeping the legs strong and straight. Six. Five. Four more. You got it. Three. Almost there. Two. And what? Okay, so from here, let's go six push ups to the right. Here we go. Six. Keep breathing. Four. Three. Hang in there. Two. And one. All right, flexing the foot and extend. For six. Five. Four, three, two, and one. And now let's take it to a pulse. Four, three, two, one. We're just going to go down. Let's hold for four, three, two, one. Good. Stretch right back and we'll release right down. Circle the shoulders around and then the other way. And we'll come up into a seated position. We'll just finish off with some light seated stretches, extending those legs, toes pointing up. We'll walk the hands in front. It is a gentle stretch. If you find you're rounding your back, bending the legs, we're holding for four, three, two, one. Let's walk the hands over to one leg. And we're gonna reach the arm up. Breathe through. Then we'll go down and we'll walk the hands center to the other leg. And let's reach that arm up. Good. And now, back to the center. Okay, see if you can go down just a little deeper. And we'll walk the hands up. Pull the legs together. Inhaling and exhaling. Two more of these. Last time. And exhale. Thank you for joining me. I hope you enjoyed that. And I hope to see you again soon.